Hi, I'm Susie Nelson Krell, and this is the second in my vlog series about how to get your home sold. We've already established your market price. We've done all the market research. Now we're working on home preparation so that the day that you go on the market, you are spiffed and spangled and ready to go. So let's get started. First, we're going to take a look at the exterior. You want to make sure that your home stands out. So you want that friend that will tell you, yes, your butt looks big in those pants and you want to stand with that friend in the middle of the street and take a look at your home and the home to the left and the home to the right. You wanna make sure that your home stands out. Does the front door need painting? Is the mailbox in good shape? How about the driveway? Does it need some pressure walking? washing. How about the drip edge around the roof line? Does that need to be pressure washed? Maybe some plantings. You want to do everything we can to make sure that your home is beautiful on the outside because you will be stalked by buyers. They will see you online and they will drive by and they'll never get an opportunity to see that kick butt kitchen or that beautiful pool area if it doesn't if your home isn't beautiful from the outside. Next, we're going to walk an inside, and the two most important things that we can do for you, or that you can do for you, <laughs> this is your homework, not mine, is to uh, clean and declutter. Uh, an old realtor friend of mine told me when I was getting in the business that clean means green, and she couldn't have been more correct. We're all comfortable with our own dirt. Heck, we don't even see it, but anybody else's dirt is pure filth. So get cleaning. Clean like your mother-in-law is coming. Make sure that you clean up. Look at the fans. Clean down. Look at the baseboards. And those things that you never even think about. What about the, uh, the exhaust filter on your microwave? All that stuff needs to be cleaned because buyers are judgy. I will tell you that. The next thing I'm going to say is that you need to declutter. After all you're moving, get all of those beautifully curated personal mementos out. Box them up because you want your home to appeal to the greatest number of, of people and they can't see themselves in your home when all they see is you. Next, let's talk a little bit about, um, about staging. Staging may be very important for you and it may not. It depends. Your situation is going to be unique and staging can run the gamut of sending all of your stuff into storage and having a stager bring in an entire household to just coming in and having a, a new uh, decor uh, person come in and rearrange the stuff in your house. So we'll talk a little bit about staging. Then another thing that we might consider while we're getting your home market ready is would it make sense to have your home pre-inspected? And that's a really, um, that's a that's, that answer is up to you. It's up to your risk appetite. You may be one of those people who doesn't want any surprises. If so, let's get you home, your home inspected and let's make any repairs prior to your going on the, on the market. Or you may say, nope, let them find it out. I think everything is fine and we'll deal with things while we're under contract. I have a full list of a hundred things you can do to get your home ready to market. If you're interested in receiving that, just send me a message, an email, give me a quick call. I can always be reached at 813-334-6611, 813 If you'd like to talk about real estate, any type of real estate, or have any questions about this, just give me a call.